How's it going guys? I'm Mike and today we're going to talk a little bit about music theory. We're going to look at the major scale. The major scale we're going to be using is C major because it's the easiest to play on the piano and a lot of songs are written in C major. The C major scale is just C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. Now the important thing to realize is that a chord is built from every single one of those notes. I repeat, a chord can be built from every single one of the notes in the C major scale. That means there are how many chords in the C major scale? Well, seven chords. C, D, E, F, G, A, B. So we're going to build those chords. All the chords in C major are built from the C major scale. So we start on C, and the first chord in the C major scale is, drum roll, C major. The second note in the C major scale is D. We have a D chord in the context of C major, and that's D minor. The next note in the C major scale is E, and we have an E chord in the context of C major, and that is E minor. Then we have F. F is the fourth note in the C major scale. We have an F chord in the key of C major, and that is F major. The next note, in the C major scale is G, and we have a G chord in the key of C major, and that is G major. The next note is A, and we have an A chord in the context of C major, and that is A minor. The next note is B. It is a B minor flat 5. We are rarely going to use that chord ever. It's uh, the B for black sheep. Okay, so the next question we're going to answer is, well, how do we build chords? Every basic chord, C major, D minor, etc., is a triad. It's made out of three notes, and those three notes are 1, 3, 5. So let's look at how we build C major. We build C major by starting with one, which is gonna be C. Then we go to three along the C major scale, which will be C, D, E. And then we go to five. So we go C, D, E, F, G. So C major is made up of C, E, and G. The next note in the C major scale is D, and as we already saw, in the context of C major, we have a D minor chord, but we build it the same way. It's one, three, five. We start with one, which is in this case D, and we go to three. We're counting up using the notes in the C major scale. Okay, so D, E, F, and then we go to five, D, E, F, G, A. So D, F, A. That's going to give you D minor. The next chord is E minor. Okay, and we build this the exact same way as all the other ones. One, three, five. One starting on E, and then we count up three. So E, F, G. And then we go up two more to the fifth, A, B. So the E minor chord is E, G, B. That's E minor. The next chord is F, okay, and it's F major. We start with F, go one, three, five. So F is one, G, A is three, B, C is five, one, three, five. F, A, C, that's F major. The next chord is G, G major. We start with one, which is gonna be G in this case. G, A, B, B is three. 
Then we go up to five, G, A, B, C, D. So G, B, D, that's G major. And then we go up to A. In the key of C, we have an A minor chord. And so let's build it, one, three, five. Start with A, count to three, A, B, C. Count to five, A, B, C, D, E. So we have A, C, E, that gives you A minor. The last chord is B, the B diminished, but it's built the exact same way. One, three, five. So we start with B, count up to three, B, C, D. So we have B and D. Now we need to get the fifth. So B, C, D, E, F. B, D, F. That gives you your B diminished. If you guys found this video helpful, please like the video and subscribe to my channel because that's very helpful to me. And I hope to see you next time.